What's going on Madden community? This is your boy Kralo coming at you with another Madden Ultimate Team video and Team of the Week Week 4 has dropped and right now we're going to go ahead and open up a bundle. But before I do, if you watch my other video and you'll probably see a little suggestion at the top, uh, you'll notice that my last video I was talking about Robert Alford and I called him a wide receiver and he's truly a corner and that's my bad. I, I was just, I don't know. I, I, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm really sorry. I mean, that like that whole segment is gone. But you know what? Let's move on. I want to apologize. Go ahead and troll me in the comments section um, in the other video. And yeah, so let's go ahead and do this, guys. As you can see real quick, we're going to go into the store. We're going to browse the store. Uh, we have some new packs. We have Team of the Week packs right here for 700, uh, 700 uh, Microsoft points. Uh, you can go ahead and get two gold or better Team of the Week players. So interesting. Um, we'll... we'll we might have to open up one of those packs and see what we pull. That's pretty crazy. Uh, but we also have an eight team of the week pack bundle uh, that we're going to go ahead and open up. Right here, you get one team of the week player needed for the hero set. So that's awesome. That means that we're going to get an elite out of our topper. Hopefully, we pull Zeke. Hopefully, we pull Zeke. Uh, but yeah, as you can see, right, it's 5,600 Microsoft points. We've already purchased those points, and um, we've already purchased the bundle. So we're going to back out. We're going to go there. And guys, wish me luck, man. We, uh, Dude, if we pull Big Ben, rip. It's over. Definitely, like, watch out for the mic, all that kind of stuff. So here you go. These are packs that I've been stashing away for quite a while from doing the gauntlet and doing other stuff. But here we go. We have the Team of the Week packs. We're going to go ahead and rip these guys right now. And then the Week 4... Team of the Week topper will open till the end. So here we go in our first pack. We're looking for red paint. That's the main thing. We get AJ McCarron. Uh, so this, this might apply to any Team of the Week, not just this week's Team of the Week. Uh, here we go. Let's go ahead and see what we can pull. We're looking for that red paint, guys. We're looking for those elite pulls. We get Jarius Bird. Our next, we get a Michael Crabtree. We will take it. Again, you need four of these guys to go ahead and do the Team of the Week upgrade. Uh, not bad at all. Uh, hopefully we pull Robert so that I can just like say the right thing about his card. Uh, but here we go. And uh, we get Paul Pazluzny. Um, There we go. Not bad at all. So we get two week four. And we just got lucky. We just happened to pull AJ McCarron out of this pack right here. Uh, let's go ahead and get into our next pack. Let's see what we can pull. Um, dude, I was seeing people pulling a whole bunch of Zeeks. Uh, we get Kawan Alexander, battle ready. This card is a monster. I have him on the No Money Spent crew uh, already. Uh, let's see real quick what we can pull out of this one. We're looking for another uh, week four card. And we're also looking, I'm telling you guys, we are looking looking for an elite. We will take Ben Roethlisberger. So please give that to us. Here we go. Our next pull is Jarvis Landry. What is our next one that we get? We get a competitive badge tip. And then what's our last thing? We get a Robert Alford. For those guys wondering, he is a cornerback. Uh, I butchered this the last video. 5'10", corner, 91 speed, 91 acceleration. Uh, now that I think about it, and I look at these stats, um, he's all right. He's all right as a corner um, and everything like that. But again, my bad, guys. My bad uh, for... for for uh, saying those wrong things about him. And we get another Robert right there. Uh, let's see what we can pull out of this next pack. And we get two Roberts in a bundle. Okay, there we go. I mean, like, this is just like, uh, hey, let's go. We get Marvin Jones. Let's get it, baby. Football outsider. Uh, we went ahead and pulled him this weekend, but it's never, like, bad to have multiple cards that we can sell. Uh, he's 6'2", 87 speed, 87 catch, 80 elusiveness, 91 spec, 82 release, uh, 88 route running, 86 catch and traffic, 87 jump. Right now, this card could be relatively cheap and good for a, like, a no money spent squad, a budget B squad, so definitely pick him up. He also has the deep threat chemistry, so I think right now we're three packs in. Uh, let's go ahead and see what we can pull right here. Um, can we clutch it out, man? We're looking for like, like um, we got Mark Barron, we're looking for Elite, but for this week, this week, this week. Um, here we go. Uh, we get Delvin. All right, come on, man. Let me just, just, just give it to me. We get another Robert. Man, dude, the, there's a lot of these guys, man. A lot. Uh, let's see what we can pull right now. Can we clutch it out with another one? Who do we get out of this one? And we get Zeke Elliott. The wrong Zeke Elliott, man. We pulled the wrong Zeke Elliott out of that pack, but that's all right, man. All right, here we go. We're going to go ahead and open up the next one. Here we get, we get Akeem Ayers. All right, we get Dante Fowler. Jags had a phenomenal, phenomenal game. Phenomenal game in London. 
Uh, let's see what we can get. We get another Paul Puzluzny. Uh Again, we can go ahead and cash these in to go ahead and do an elite player. So we'll probably do that uh, for sure. Let's see what we get right here. We get John Sullivan, and we get an elite. And who do we pull? We pull Tremaine Johnson. We will take it. Uh, that gives that opportunity to get closer to building out that card. So we get our first elite. So out of these elites, the ones that we want are Zeke, ideally. Uh, we want to go ahead and pull Zeke uh, for sure so we can add him on the squad and do some cool stuff. Here we go. Let's see what we get right here. We get Martellus Bennett. All right. Um, I don't know who that guy is. But here we go. Come on, man. Come on. We get Marcus Peters, Team of the Week. This is a really great card. And we pull an Elite. And who do we get? We get Doug Baldwin, Seattle Seahawk. Let's freaking go. My boy Dougie is going to be on the squad. Uh, that is not a bad pull right there. We'll take it and then see what else we can pull right now. Can we get another Elite? Or can we get another Team of the Week player? Because we've been pulling these Team of the Week players out of packs pretty well. And we do. Robert, I'm telling you, I butchered his name. So he's going to just choose to show up in every... I, I butchered his name and his position. So he's coming out in every single pack right now. But not not bad at all. Not bad at all. We got one more pack to go, I believe. Let's go ahead and see before the topper. Oh, uh, no, we got two more packs. We get Will Fuller. Now, I really wanted this card. Why? Because he has insane speed. He's six foot, 91 speed, 84 catch, um, 86 spec catch, 82 release, 81 route running, 85 jumping. I'm telling you, he was just killing it, killing it this weekend um, at, at the detriment of De DeAndre Hopkins, who I have in fantasy. So it kind of hurt me a little bit. But hey, hey, you know what? Uh, good for them. Um, you know, they, they actually have another wide receiver that's going to be doing great on their squad. Let's see real quick here. Come on, man. Come on. Just give me, give me Zeke. All I want is Zeke. All I want is Zeke. And we get another Robert. Dude, I am freaking done. I'm freaking done. All right, here we go. We're going to go ahead and open up our last pack. Our last pack. And we, hold on, hold on, hold on. And we pull Zeke, baby. Let's freaking go. We get Zeke out of our last pack. We will take it. We will take it. We get another AJ McCarron. Um, that is awesome. Here we go. Not bad at all, man. I'm so glad we got Zeke. Let's check out his stats, guys. I, I just got to check this out. Uh, 90 speed, 90 agility. 89 acceleration, 88 carry, 91 ball carrier vision, uh, 87 elusiveness. He's not the truckster, man, but that speed makes up for it. Good to have him on the squad. Uh, here we go. Let's see. So out of this bundle, we pulled Tremaine Johnson. We pulled Doug Baldwin. We pulled Zeke. Uh, so we've had some really nice pulls. Uh, let's see if we can kind of finish this out with another Team of the Week player. Um, and if it's elite, hey, we'll take it. And then the last card we get is a mouthpiece. All right. So there we go. Let's go ahead and back out. And we have our week four team of the week topper. So we have Zeke. We got Tremaine Johnson. Uh, so it's either Steve Smith. And if I recall, we also have Zach Brown. So I would not mind a Zach Brown out of this pool right here. And here we go. What do we get? We get a Steve Smith. We'll take it. Hey, we'll take it. I mean, we're, all we have to do is go buy Zach Brown. We can probably do Carlos Dunlap. Uh, but, you know, we got quite a bit of that. Not just that, but we might have enough items to go ahead and do the Team of the Week upgrade. Let's go ahead and check that out real quick. Let's see how much those cards are going for, uh, first and foremost. Let's go... Actually, let me, go, let me go into my binder, and we'll search that way. Here we go. Uh, we're going into the binder. Uh, we have a ton of Team of the Week Alfred's, it's insane. It is truly insane. We're doing this live right now during the stream. We got 31 team of the weeks. We're gonna sort by. Look at this, guys. One, two, three, four, five, six. This is insane, insane, insane. How much is he going for? Let's just see how much he's going for. He's probably going for like 2k. Now I saw somebody, man. They went ahead and opened out of their like 3k, 3k. I missed 3k. We'll take it. I missed 3k. But I saw somebody in their bundle opening, man. They actually pulled. It was insane. Five Zeeks. Five Zeeks, man. Five Zeeks. That's insane. It's just crazy. Um, let's go ahead and check out how much Zeke is going for right now. Um, we have uh, this buy now for about 38K. So his price has gone up because when I was looking at him, it was like 20, 25, 28K earlier today. Uh, let's see. We have Steve Smith. Let's check out Steve Smith's price. He's going for about... 22k and the reason why i'm checking the elite prices is because we got michael crabtree um you know and and, and we, we have paul Puzluzny, we got al ford um 
we got a few of these cards that we can actually do this set, but I want to make sure that I'm not overspending because it may be cheaper just to go ahead and sell Crabtree. So 8K, so you do the math right there. We might just go ahead and do an elite upgrade and see if we pull Zach Brown. Let me go ahead and check real quick here. Um, where's Paul? There you go. We got Paul right here. Let's see what he's going for. I want to say 7K, 9K, not bad, 9K. So you had 9 plus 3 is 12. You add another 10. That's 22. So you know what? Now that I'm thinking about it, we need one more card. It may not be the best thing for us to go ahead and do that. But uh, that was kind of our pack opening right there, 15K. So in the end, when you really think about this, I can go ahead and put all the, I can sell those cards and actually make enough coin to go buy somebody that I really want. Um, but if I put them in the set, it's kind of like, I may not be able to pull anything. I don't know if I can pull, uh, you know, the, um, I don't know if I can pull the Jimmy Graham or the Carlos Dunlap out of that. If I can, I don't know. I might reconsider. But uh, yeah, guys, that's kind of our bundle opening. I hope you guys enjoyed watching it. This is your boy Kralo signing out. Peace.